doing my final vlog entry on Amelie, a French film directed by Jean-Pierre Junet, which was released in 2001. I want to focus on the quirkiness of Amelie, and specifically how the cinematography helped bring out her personality. Amelie is a shy and intriguing French barista who finds a box in her apartment filled with childhood belongings of a man who lived in, her, in the apartment before her. She goes around to different people within the apartment asking if they know who this man may have been. She later finds out who he is and hands the box to him without him knowing who she is. She observes the emotion that overwhelms him and wants to provide the same happiness to other people within her life. She does this to many people in her town and in her apartment, but later on in the movie she finds out that she uh, is only doing this to help build a hole within herself that is lacking in happiness and um, self-actualization. She later finds out how to fill that hole through a relationship with a man she meets in um, a subway. Um, I want to talk about the framing the shot and how the director uses cinematography to help bring out um, Lee's personality. Um, first of all, e throughout the film, there is a slight yellow tint that makes each shot feel warmer and slightly older. Um, also, there is the use of soft lighting, which helps make Amelie seem more innocent and quirky and somewhat childish in her mannerisms. The framing of the shot. Uh, within this huge category, um, Amelie, the film Amelie uses a lot of depth control coupled with zoom especially with zooming in on characters to help bring out their own personality, such as Amelie's quirkiness with a slight, um, with like her quirky smile. Um, the director also uses symmetry throughout the film, similar to Wes Anderson. Almost every shot is centered on an object or a person that Jean-Pierre wants the viewer to really focus on, especially within moving and zooming. Moving on to motion, there is almost there is motion in almost every shot, and the shots where there aren't motion are very purposeful and make the scene want to seem very awkward. Um, also, with an eye level, is very important. Most shots are taken so that the character's eyes are in the top third of the shot. This makes it comfortable for the audience to get to know each character. Amelie also breaks the fourth wall on multiplication, which gives the audience a closer connection to her. So that basically wraps up my analysis of the film Amelie. I really enjoy this movie. It's one of my favorite French films, and I would suggest it to anyone who wants to experience a foreign film. Thanks.